Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading The Remarried Empress, episode 142. Due to Webtoon's due policy, I do have to blur 50% of this episode. So if you guys want to read it along with me, it's available on webtoons.com. For anyone out there who wants to support me and also gain early access to all my content, not deal with censorship and not deal with the cat logo blurs, they're all available on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Ooh. Hunting? Yes, it's nothing grand. I just thought we should get some fresh air. Come to think of it, both my brother and Sebastian were also fond of outdoors activities, such as hunting and horseback riding at his age. No wonder he's feeling restless. He's confined to his desk in, his, in the prime of his life. That sounds agreeable. But about the preparations, McKenna will take care of it all. Don't worry. Oh, they were so intimate. A few days later at the Western Empire's Imperial Hunting Grounds. Oh, their outfit. I'm going to hunt a bear and enhance Her Majesty's standing. But I heard there are no bears here. They keep dangerous beasts out of this area since it's so close to the palace. Bears can be found anywhere, my lady. Keep your distance. I want to spend some time alone with my wife. Uh, pardon? But your majesty. You don't mind, do you? No, that's fine. Clip, 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 clip. I can feel the warm, lazy sun. Oh my gosh, I can feel the warm, lazy sunlight streaming down. I can smell the scent of fresh grass carried over by the breeze. And a smile like swaying foxtails. I came here for Henry's sake, but it's lifting my mood as well. Huh? I think I see something over there. Clip, clip. Oh. Hey, yeah! I'll bring you back a present, my queen. Henry? What exactly did he see? How far into the forest did he go? <gasps> We've strayed far away from the Imperial Guards. Oh! oh. C Henry! Henry, are you alright? What happened? Oh! Is that a little fox? The Remarried Empress, Episode 142. The camp in front of the hunting grounds of all the creatures to grapple with. Your Majesty, a fox kit? It's better than a squirrel. I waited for a while, but the only prey coming my way was that fox and some squirrels. Ugh. <laughs> well, at least Her Majesty found it charming. Battle wound from the fight with a fox kit. Oh my gosh. She brought you back to camp and praised you for your cute performance. The return of the Emperor. Oh, and that's the problem. Flop. Oh, for goodness sake. The, huh? Mm. Henry? Is he behaving like that because he's embarrassed? How cute. He can't stay here all day. I should cheer him up. Pat, pat. Huh? Feeling bold today, are we, McKenna? Move, you're heavy. Oh. <laughs> this infuriating bird, he thinks I'm heavy? <sighs> Recently, you don't think I'm too heavy? You're as light as a feather. I doubt that. Tell me the truth. Well... You're the perfect weight to hold in my arms. I adore you, my queen. I love everything about you, my queen. I believed him when he said all those endearing things. But now he wants me to move because I'm too heavy? T st st oh. I want her to think I was gallant. Gallant. T Are you still moping? Hmm. Do you really need to ask when you've been here the whole time? Pardon? I stopped outside for a bit when your Her Majesty came in. Huh? What? <gasps> then 
She's the one who was leaning on me. Meanwhile, in the palace of the Western Empire. Your Majesty, the public opinion of you is becoming increasingly unfavorable. People hold you in contempt as these rumors started, started not long after the king passed away. Wouldn't it be a good idea to leave the uh, for Compshire? It is not that I believe the rumors are true. I just think that they'll die down if you stay away from the public eye for a while. Then you can return when the circumstances are more... Was... I was first. <sighs> the scandal could have been explained away as a misunderstanding if it weren't for the fact that Lady Krista has had feelings for Emperor Henry for a long time. She even rejected a proposal to become the crown prince's wife once. So if she wants to shut down the rumors... Emery is right, your majesty. I know it's infuriating, but you must restore your good name. We're nearly the same age, and we've lo both lost our husbands. So why am I the only one in this terrible position? So she does have feelings for Henry. It's not fair. I won't back down. If I were to go to, to, go to Compshire now, my life would effectively be over. Days will turn to months and years, and I'll quietly ebbed away without having achieved anything. Since it's the hand I've been dealt with, I'll turn those rumors about me to my advantage. She's a stubborn one. Oh my goodness. Krista doesn't know when to just give up and just go, but now I'm kind of curious. She said that she hasn't accomplished everything that she want. So what is it that she wants to accomplish? Is there stuff in like the empire that she wants to help others with? Is there something that she wants to leave a marking with, like a legacy? Or is it just King Henry that she wants? And I don't know if the, if she's going, she's doing all this for a man. She should she should definitely stop. Don't ever be chasing a man or anyone you attract. Okay, you don't chase, you attract. And that's a thing that I stand by forever, for the rest of my life. I would never ever chase someone to be in my life, friends or family or a man. But if there's more to her life that she wants to do, then yeah, okay, let's see it. But if it's a man, girl, bye. But I'm surprised this episode did not have anything to do with Sobatio and Rashta. So I think maybe next episode we might see them again. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!